What is going on, guys? Thank you for jumping on this week's playbook training. My name is Zach Boxer. I'm a platinum earner in Vima. Uh, we're going to get started in just about one second. Unfortunately, if you were on the webinar platform, we had a couple issues, so we're actually switching it to YouTube. So I'm going to give it about a minute before you get started. So everyone, tell your teams last second, jump on YouTube. This is going to be recorded if you want to go back and watch it again. Cool. What's up, guys? Uh, we're going to get started. Uh, again, people were switching over to this platform, so I'm just going to get started. Thank you for jumping on this week's playbook training. I'm excited to be on here. I haven't been on here actually in a long time. Unfortunately, maybe that was one of the reasons we had some technical issues. Mm -hmm. But anyway, excited to be on this week's playbook training call. Uh, for those of you that don't know my story, again, my name is Zach Boxer, 22 years old. I've been involved in the opportunity now for about two years. I'm excited to be a part of this opportunity. Uh, couldn't be more excited for where we're at right now, but just to give you a little bit about, about my story, I've been involved, like I said, for about two years now. I was going to Penn State at the time when I first got involved in this opportunity. A friend of mine from the gym got me involved. Uh, couldn't be more excited when I first started, but unfortunately, he wound up quitting for, for various reasons when I first got started. Uh, and because of that, I had a long learning curve. Uh, I, 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 it took me a long time to learn how to, how to build this the right way. The reason why I bring that up is because I didn't have a system. No one truly taught me the right and wrong things to do. But because I was ambitious, because I was a hardworking kid and I saw what was possible, that didn't matter to me. And it took, yes, it took me a couple months and I had a bit of a learning curve, but I made it work and I learned, we learned how to build this the right way. But the cool part about it now is that we, we talk about there's never been a better time to get started because we have developed a system. You guys have heard about the playbook. A lot of people have their hands on them. If you don't have your hands on a playbook, what I recommend you do is reach upline, find someone in a leadership position that can get their hands on a playbook in bulk and give you one. You know, unfortunately, right now, there are not a lot of them in circulation. But what's very cool, you know, we have a lot of them now. But the, the, the sales of the playbooks now is going to go into funding more playbooks. And our next shipment with the with the with the release of our next shipment the goal is to have a website up that you can actually go on and one click get them sent to you so that's very exciting so for the next half hour i'm going to be going a through z all throughout the playbook how to utilize it the right way and how to implement it into your business to get to the results that you want so first of all this is the playbook if you guys have a playbook like i said follow along with me if you don't take take some notes i highly recommend it until you get your hands on one Right, so like I said, this is the cover of the playbook. Something that looks very, very professional. Something that I can walk around with and be very proud of it. I can imagine kids walking around with these at school, hundreds of people walking around with these proud of what they are and people are gonna look at these and go, hey, what is that? You know, I've been to a bunch of home events where I actually pull out a playbook and show the newest person one of these and that's actually lots of times a deciding factor because they love having a physical book in their hands that's gonna help them get the results that they want, you know? So when you flip open the book, the first page, you see Vima, the future of business, right? Now, right below there, there's a quote from Ambassador Leader Lou Kish that says, we are networking products that people already spend money on. Throughout the most socially connected generation the world has ever seen, during one of the worst economies since the Great Depression, it just makes sense. So what I recommend you do, if you're a new person, Break that down, make that make sense to you. Because once that makes sense to you, it's gonna make sense to other people. But if it doesn't make sense to you what we're doing, that's gonna definitely something you need to get your head around before to getting to the next step, right? So when you flip over to the next page, very simple, there's a table of contents. You guys could definitely go through that, but we're gonna be going through the entire book together. So next page is your personal profile. A very, very important page in my eyes, something that you definitely, definitely need to fill out 
when you're new because what it's going to do is it's going to get you in contact with people that are here to help you every step of the way right so name address phone number email vids very very simple stuff your vid you can get from your uh from your app when you log into your back office you get that that's very important to have if you're ever calling beam if you ever have any questions that's very very important but right below there enroller upline diamond platinum executive presidential the reason for this is to get in contact with people that are here to help you but on top of that where you see twitter and instagram it's because you you want good quality content in your news feeds like i don't know how many of you you guys would like agree with me that i don't like seeing negative posts in my news feed if people are posting negatively i typically unfriend them or i'll stop following them do you know what i mean so if you connect with these top earners in the industry you 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 follow them on instagram and twitter you know you have their phone number readily available to you do what's going to happen is you're going to be constantly getting good the good ideas put into your head and as a result you're kind of you're going to learn from them you know what i mean so i recommend again follow everyone on twitter instagram and if you're if you've been in the business longer i what i recommend you do cross off where it says diamond platinum executive presidential and write higher rankings you know the biggest thing i've learned from this is for people to utilize a system you as a leader should lead by example and become a product of the system you know so flip to the next page to probably the most important page in the entire playbook which is dreams you know a person without dreams is like a ship without a rudder you know you you you, you need dreams that are going to drive you and basically you know you need to be real with yourself the first part dreams describe your dream lifestyle Right. You need to visualize why you're doing Vima. Don't just write something such as, you know, I want to retire my parents. I want to make a lot of money. You want to find something that truly, truly drives you and is going to make you do what it takes to be successful. If you guys look around my room, I'm actually going to show you. I highly recommend having your goals in front of you. Make a dream board. Have things that are going to constantly visual, like, like, like drive you every step of the way to help because you're going to have ups and downs in this business, you know? But the thing is, if you constantly focus on your dreams and why you're doing Vima, nothing is going to matter to you because you're focusing on why you're what you're getting out of this, right? So for me, for example, I've always wanted to start my own gyms. I've always wanted to start my own businesses. For me, it's the freedom. It's not the money. It's the freedom the money provides. And that is enough to wake me up every morning with, on a mission, excited about where this is going to take me. And the coolest part about it is I'm in complete control. So what I recommend, Donald Trump says it best, if you're going to dream anyway, why not dream big? You know, so that's huge. Definitely establish your dreams. But on top of that, why me? Why me is very important because if you don't believe in yourself, there's no way you're going to be successful in this. You know, for me, I'm a personal trainer. I'm hugely passionate in sharing products with people. I'm genuinely passionate in helping others. Why are you going to be successful in Vima? What characteristics do you have that are going to make you a successful person in this business, right? That's huge. Definitely take the time to fill out those two. And the last one, especially if you're new, why Vima? Why do you believe in Vima? If you don't believe in Vima, no one else is going to believe in Vima. So you need to sell yourself on this concept before you can sell others on it, right? So for me, Vima offers a product line that everyone's looking for. It offers an opportunity that every kid my age and every adult is looking for, an extra source of income. And our leadership is par none. You know, we have incredible leadership we're working with, and it's exciting that everyone has a vested interest in helping you succeed. So what I recommend is fill out this page, really take some time, and don't just fill it out to say you filled it out. Genuinely find what's going to drive you. Fill this out and look at it every single morning when you wake up and every single night when you go to sleep, right? So that's what I highly recommend. Flip to the next page. So now this is very straightforward. It's just Vima's income disclosure, right? Now, obviously, you can look at that on your own time. But what I recommend you look at is the bottom, something that's very important. If you look at the Vima customer versus affiliate profile in 2013, 70% customers, 30% affiliates. At the end of 2013, there were only 105,000 people doing this in a company that's now open in almost 60 countries. It is truly a ground floor opportunity, and that excites me. That really does. You know, but definitely look at that on your own time. But what I really want to get to is the goals page. This is very, very, very important because a person without goals is a ship without a rudder. You know, you need goals to be in control of where you're going. If you if a ship doesn't have a rudder, you're in no control of where you're going. You're just going. 
You know what I mean? So if you break it down and you have realistic goals, you are in complete control of where you're going. And then especially in an industry like this where you're in complete control of your income, that's very important, right? So what we break down is achieving bronze, right? For a new person, it's very realistic to visualize hitting bronze. So whenever you satisfy 180 points on one side of your business and 360 on the other, you complete what's known as one cycle. A cycle pays at $20. And that might not sound like a lot to you, but when you hit bronze and you cycle once, that's huge. Because once you hit, once you cycle once, you can cycle 100 times. and you cycle 100 times, you can cycle 1,000 times. The only difference is time and effort and duplication, right? Now, the thing about this is focus on showing the newest person a realistic goal. You know, obviously talk about the crazy incomes. Hey, you can make millions of dollars in an opportunity like this. You can, but break it down into terms that the average person can understand because not everyone will understand a million dollar opportunity, right? But if you show someone, hey, you can make an extra 500 bucks a month, an extra thousand bucks a month, get you to gold, get you the ranking of diamond, then people can definitely understand that. You know, I like to talk about SMART goals. I don't know if you've ever heard of SMART goals. It stands for specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, timely. I'm going to repeat that. Specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and timely. Right Now, what, the reason why I'm saying that is by no means am I not telling you to dream big. You should be dreaming as big as you possibly can, right? But break it down into terms that you can very easily follow and get to the next level. Right. There's an analogy I'll always use where imagine, you know, I'm in New York right now and I want to drive to California. Right. I can't see California from where I am right now. Right. But I can get in my car right now. I could type in an address in California and then drive there, probably only seeing a couple feet in front of me at night. Right. But the thing is, if I follow the directions and believe in what I'm doing and go one step at a time, next thing I know, I'll be in California. And that's the exciting part about it, because right now you might not be able to visualize if you're new getting in a car. You know, if you're brand new, you might not be able to visualize a six-figure income or a seven-figure income, right? But you can very easily visualize cycling once, cycling five times, cycling 10 times, right? So break it down into terms that you can visualize right now. For me, I'm a platinum leader. I would love to be an ambassador, you know, uh, pinnacle, legend. Those are my goals, right? But right now, realistically, I can see executive. I can see presidential. So what I'm doing is I'm focusing on the bigger picture, but at the same time, I'm breaking it down into realistic goals one step at a time, you know? So that's very huge. At the bottom, goals, first customer, first affiliate if you're brand new, bronze, silver, gold, diamond. Write down dates that you realistically think between you and you that you can hit these goals and hold yourself accountable. You know, don't just write these down like I was saying, just to just say, hey, I filled up my playbook. Write these down and the intention that you're going to hold yourself accountable to these and you're going to make them happen. Right. And again, like I said, you are the one in complete control. You are the one setting these up. So do what you think is right. You know, people will ask me, hey, do you think I can hit bronze my first month? Or hey, do you think I can hit diamond my first month? My answer is, do you? If you do, then you're right. If you don't, if you don't think you can hit diamond your first month, then you can't. If you don't think you can hit bronze your first month, get free product, you probably can't. If you can, then you will. You know. So next page, very very straightforward. Contacts list, both for customers and for affiliates. Right. What you want to have is you want to have something called an active candidate list which means that you want to constantly be adding new people to your list that you're meeting on a daily basis. Because we all know that the larger your list is, the larger your business will become, right? At the same time, if you have a very small list, odds are you probably will have a very small business. But the thing is, you know, you might be thinking to yourself right now, hey, I don't know a ton of people, but you probably have a thousand friends on Facebook. You probably sit in class next to tons of kids every single day. You probably have a lot of family, you have a lot of friends, right? For me, being home, I kind of thought, well, you know, hey, I'm through a lot of my market, right? I just started going to a new gym. I went there yesterday. There are so many kids there my age. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start working on going and becoming friends with them, adding them to my list, right? Not immediately going after them with the intention of getting them involved, but going after them right now with the intention of making it friends, right? And the, that's the thing. You want to develop the trust relationship, right? So this is very straightforward, this page. What we recommend is 500 to 1,000 names or more. You know, as many names as you could possibly put on these lists, both for people just interested in the products for our customers or people interested in doing the business, right? And what's cool about it is next to the name on the customer side, 
it also lists favorite product or need for product. So going back to intention, when you're calling up a customer, if you write down, hey, favorite product or need for product, what happens is you're now calling them with an intention. Hey, you know what? I know you're interested in coffee. Hey, I know you're interested in iced tea. You should definitely try this product, right? That's very huge. And I'm going to go in in a few minutes into actually how to go after people like from a product standpoint or from an affiliate standpoint, right? But now on the affiliate side, name, desire, or need for opportunity. So that goes after the same thing. It's it, it's changing intention. It's not just hey, I want to make a quick buck off of you. It's instead hey, I want to help you because you need another source of income. I want to help you because you're a social guy and you want extra income. I want to go after you. I, I want to. I want you. I want to work with you because I know you'd be interested in these products. I know you'd love an extra source of income. I know that you just lost your job and you would love to have an extra source of income coming in. Or I know you need a job. You know. So if you go after people with the genuine intention of helping them, and this list helps you because you now know why you're calling them. You know. So again, I definitely recommend you get through that. But now, well, like I was talking about the approach, this is very very important. But the biggest thing I'll tell you about approach, about talking to people about the products and about the opportunity, is there's no cookie cutter way of talking to people. A lot of times, people will go out, and like talk to me, and they'll go, "Hey, well, you know, what, what script should I use to talk to my friends, or how should I talk to them this and that?" I just say, honestly, it's all situational, and that's the biggest thing you should understand. But we gave a sample customer approach and a sample affiliate approach just to give you a general idea. What I'll recommend is don't text people. Call people, you know, or, 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 or Skype people. You don't want to text people. You don't want to Facebook message because there's no excitement there. And if you're excited, people are going to be excited. If you're monotone, people are going to be monotone, right? So what I recommend, definitely leading with the products because the products are phenomenal. I've gen I, I don't think I've ever met someone who doesn't like at least one of our products. I know when I first got involved, uh, my mom didn't like Verb, but every single day now, she drinks an, a, a mojo. She absolutely loves Mojo. My dad is obsessed with Verve Bold, right? And they share with their friends whether or not they're even making money with it, right? So lead with the products. Let someone try it. When they like it, they're going to come back to you and they're going to ask, hey, how can I get more? Hey, you know what? It's funny you, you asked that. Dude, hey, you know what? There's also an opportunity that if you want, we can team up together and share these products with people and make some extra money, right? And that's the business of the future, networking, because that's what we do all the time. We just don't get paid to do it. With this, we do. So the products make complete sense. And going back to, like I said, on this page, it says check your intentions. People can see completely through what you're doing. So focus on helping people, right? And that's what both from a customer standpoint and from an affiliate standpoint, if people see that you're not in this just to get them involved, if you're in this to help them genuinely, then they're definitely going to be more inclined to check this out, right? And there are three big bolts at the bottom. Be excited, be vague, and be exclusive. You know, so I definitely recommend you go through all of these and, you know, do that. And now it says stop. Practice these with your enroller until you become comfortable with it. Practice makes perfect. You know, it's going to take time and effort to get very, very good at these. But with time and effort, you're going to see that your skills are going to definitely improve. You know, so going on to the next page, how to run a proper home event, right? Now, th there's a lot of stuff on here that I'm not really going to go too into. Like I said, Definitely take the time to read this stuff yourself and see what works for you, right? But the biggest part about it is something called a credibility triangle. This is huge, right over here, right? Credibility triangle. Now, with the credibility triangle, what it's basically breaking down is something called edification, right? Now, when you're brand new, you probably can't explain Vima. And even if you can, there's no way you could break it down completely to friends go over everything and on top of that they're gonna go hey you know what this sounds great how much money are you make right so pretty much it's a triangle right there's you there's the prospect and then there's the expert so basically you and the prospect share a trust relationship then you and the expert have a credibility relationship so basically your objective is to get your prospect to talk to the expert you know hey dude I'm very very excited about this opportunity I want you to meet my upline Maggie She's one of the top girls in this company. She's making a, a ton of money with this. I would love for you to meet her, right? And at that point, it's taken off my shoulders, put on hers. And what happens is me as a new person, I listen to Maggie explaining the opportunity, right? All the meanwhile, I'm learning it. And kind of like a song, after you hear a song over and over and over, you can eventually repeat the lyrics. What happens is with this, eventually, you know how to explain it, right? You throw in your little twist and bam, 
And at that point, you go from being someone dependent on someone else to now duplicating that throughout your team, right? So it's a very, very simple concept, the credibility triangle. I definitely recommend you look through this. I mean, very simply, you know, encourage new people to arrive early, more, more professional standpoint, welcoming environment, you know, cold products, putting a TV, you know, putting a TV set up that you can plug in a computer, uh, making guests comfortable, right? And then sharing and getting questions answered, you know? But really, this is the meat of, of, of everything I'm talking about tonight. This is why we're all here, and this is why we're all excited, right? The success system. There is a webinar channel that you're checking out right now that every Tuesday and Wednesday night, there is a webinar, someone who is a top earner in the elite network going through on Tuesday nights, the opportunity on Wednesday nights, like you're watching tonight, a playbook training. There's a SoundCloud account. There's a YouTube channel that you're watching this on right now. There's a Facebook group. Every Friday of the new rank advancement period, which is every four weeks, there's a new rank advancement call. Every Saturday at 11 Pacific, 2 p.m. Uh, Eastern, there's a quick start training call for the newest person to get on how to take your business from the beginning and start it off the right way, how to launch your business, right? And then every Sunday at the same time on the same number, there's a six-figure mentorship call, which is how to take your business to the next level. Right. It's no longer, hey, I'm just getting started. This is like, hey, I want to make a six figure income. I'm going to learn from an expert. And there is someone every Sunday on that making a six figure income or above, teaching you their insights on how to take your business to the next level. Right. But now, like I was saying before, in order to get your team to follow this system that I'm outlining right now, you as a leader need to set the example and do it yourself. Become a product of the system, and people are going to see your results and they're going to follow you. Right. Because this system is proven. It is proven, and we've studied people, the, the, the top earners in the industry, Holton Bugs, Tom Alcaz, and Brian Carruthers, people that have built organizations to hundreds of thousands of people. And we found that the golden thread that runs through all of them is it's not that they're incredible at what they do. They develop systems, and they let the systems develop the business, and they just push the system along. Because how are you supposed to be able to know that people – like six months to a year from now, or learning the exact same stuff that you are. Up until this point, a lot of leaders that are on here right now listening to me would agree that it was kind of us almost playing telephone, where, yeah, yeah, you know, we could tell all the information, but eventually it was getting lost in translation, right? And we as leaders realized that to take our next level, to take our businesses to the next level, to facilitate long term sustainable growth to hundreds of thousands of people, right? We needed to, to develop a systematic business that you can put the hand into the hands of the newest person, right? So that's why we're excited. Why I'm excited about the playbook is that for the first time ever, I have complete confidence that I can enroll anyone, anywhere in the country, anywhere in the world, right? And if they plug into what we are doing right now, I know that they're learning what I'm learning and they're going to be in the same, you know, at the same point that I'm at. But now based on their own efforts, they can go as far with this as they want. I can get a kid enrolled in California, right? And what's cool about it is he can start plugging into the system, right? And I go fly out there. They're running home events the exact same way I am. They're listening to the same calls I am. They're, they're learning from the same things, reading the same books as me, and that's exciting, right? But basically at the bottom, this is very important. We list off a couple books and audios that we recommend you listen to when you first get started or read. There are so many times people come up to me and ask me, hey, what book should I read? Hey, what audio should I be listening to, right? What I recommend is going through these six books and audios and not just reading or listening to them just to say I got through them. Read them and listen to them and master them, right? I remember talking to Brad Alcazan, the number two earner in this company right now, and he told me that these are all he read and listened to until he hit presidential, right? But the thing was he went in and he mastered these, right? So like I said, being a product of the system, read these, go through these again, master these, First seven days audio with Darren Hardy, building your network marketing business with Jim Rohn, Art of Recruiting by Art Williams, The Compound Effect by Darren Hardy, Business of the 21st Century by Robert Kiyosaki, and probably the best book out of all of them, Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. That book has created so many millionaires, people that have took the time to, to read that book and to master it and then apply it into their lives. And that's the biggest thing about it. Don't just read these to read them. Read these to master them and then to apply them into your business, right? Because knowledge without action is just potential, you know? 
So basically, again, all these things are recorded. Quick start training calls, six-figure mentorship calls are put in the SoundCloud account. The uh, the webinars are posted in the YouTube channel. The Facebook group keeps everyone in alignment. So that's very, very exciting. But my favorite page probably in the entire playbook is this last one, the checklist, right? I've been going over a lot with you guys over the last 15, 20 minutes, right? But this checklist breaks down everything for the newest person. Set up an audit delivery, check. Send a new W9 form, check. Complete your contact list, check. Have four home events, check. It goes on and on and on, and I'm not gonna go through all of them. Definitely take the time to read them, but the biggest thing about it is at the bottom, commit to being here a year from now. And that's a quote from Darren Hardy, the publisher and editor of Success Magazine. At the bottom, it's like it says, I, Zach Boxer, will work to the best of my ability in Vima and give this opportunity an honest effort over the next 12 months in accordance to my goals and dreams. I am committed to being involved in actively building my Vima business from year one from today. And then sign date. That is huge because the biggest thing about it is coming into this with the mindset that I will be here a year from now. If you're coming into this now to make a quick buck, you should not be involved. This is about building a long-term sustainable income. And up until this point, it's been possible. But now with the addition of this playbook, with the addition of what the Elite Network is doing, it, it has never been more possible than it is is right now there's never been a better time to be involved than there is right now and this system is going to make it that way you know so again there are lots of audios you know webinars training calls and whatnot every single week but the coolest thing about it is there's now in the playbook there is a calendar with all the calls with all the trainings monthly goals on the side and it, it is absolutely incredible if you use this as your daily calendar I definitely think that you will see phenomenal growth. You will be plugged into all the calls, into all the trainings, and you will be in complete control of what you want to do with this. So again, so this gets me very, very excited. The playbook is something that is going to facilitate our growth to the top of this company, right? But the thing about this, right, is this is kind of like a workout plan. You know, Vima is like the gym. Right, you can spend the money every single month to go to the gym. You know, forty bucks a month, fifty bucks a month, sixty bucks a month, whatever it is. You could spend that every single month to go to the gym, and then imagine you go to the gym, you find a guy that has your dream physique, and you go, "Hey, dude, give me a workout plan. I want to look exactly like you." And he sits you down, he gives you an exact workout plan, and says, "If you follow this, you will look exactly like me." Right? But the thing is, some people will commit to it. Some people will commit to the grueling hours, you know, of working out every day, of eating the right way. And other people, like the New Year's resolution people, will give it about a week or about a month and they'll say, hey, you know what? I give up. Can't do it. Right. So, like this with the playbook, if you follow this system, you will get the results. But if you don't, I'm not to say you're not going to succeed, but it's not guaranteed you're going to. With the playbook, you are guaranteed to see the results you're looking for, but the time it takes you to get there is completely situational. You know, if you're working a job, if you're in school and all this and that, you could still make Vima work, but on your own time. It's completely what you put into it is what you're going to get out of it. The more time you put into Vima, the more time, the more results you're going to get out of it. The less time you put into Vima, the less you're going to get out of it. But you're in complete control of that. You know, so, so to sum it up, you know, again, thank you guys for jumping on the call tonight. I'm excited. Uh, unfortunately, again, I'm sorry for the people that were trying to watch us on the uh, on the webinar platform. Definitely, this is going to be recorded. Definitely check this out. Share this with your teams and follow the system. I'm a guy that's been involved for two years now. I still utilize the system. I'm a product of the system, and I've never been more excited about where this is going. I've never been more confident in my abilities as well as the abilities of my team because I know that every single person on my team anywhere in the, around the country, anywhere around the world are being taught exactly what I'm being taught and we are in complete alignment, you know? So the future is bright. I'm definitely excited. Connect with me on social media and I look forward to talking to you guys soon. Have a good night.